Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Storytime with Fade. And today we will be reading Sun in My Tummy. It's written by Laura Allery and illustrated by Andrea Blinick. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. And let's jump right in. Sun in My Tummy. You wake up in the dark. The blankets hug you tight and you snuggle deeper. It can't be time to get up yet, but it is. Time to put the sun in your tummy. In the kitchen, a pot of water bubbles on the stove. In goes the oatmeal. Here comes the sun. Not long ago, these oats were a field of swaying grasses. Before that, seeds snuggled deep in the dark earth, like you in your blankets. What woke them? The sun. It tickled those sleepy little seeds and called them to rise and shine. They were hungry and thirsty, so they gobbled food from the soil and drank rain from the clouds. Bursting out of their cozy seed coats, they stretched up and up, reaching for the sun, while their roots went down into the earth. Those oats grew tall and green, then turned to gold. Hidden inside were all the things that had made them grow. Clouds, rain, soil, sun. They're hard to see, but look deeper. Everything is there. What's next? Blueberries. Once they grew wild on low bushes with smooth green leaves, inside those leaves, real magic happened. It began with the sun who showers the earth with heat and light, tiny packets of energy. You can feel its warmth on your skin, but green plants can do something more, something amazing. The leaves of that blueberry bush caught the sun energy and used it to break apart gases in the air. Then they put the pieces back together to make something new, sugar, food from thin air. When the time was right, those blueberry bushes burst into bloom. Bees, birds, and butterflies flitted from flower to flower. Deep inside each bloom, seeds began to form. Around the seeds, soft and juicy coats. These are the berries, sugar sweet. Some of them were gobbled up by birds and animals. Others dropped to the ground. When seeds go to the back of the soil, they make new plants, which make more seeds, which make more plants. On and on it goes. Do you see? The bush, the blossoms, the green leaves, the sun and air they use to make their sweet magic. All the plants and seeds that came before. All the plants and seeds that might grow someday. Everything is there in each blueberry. Try one. Is it sweet? Is that the taste of sunlight? Oatmeal and blueberries need milk. Watch how it swirls with purple from the berries in your bowl. What else do you see? Can you see the cow that gave the milk? A cow in your cereal bowl? How funny. Picture her munching sweet green grass that grew in soil, watered by rain, that came from clouds, formed by oceans, warm by the sun, and inside every blade of grass, that same magic, food made from air and sunlight, for you and every living thing. All of it is there in every drop of milk. Inside everything, if you look deep enough, you will find the sun, warm-hearted, generous, giving. Take a big spoonful. Does it warm you from the inside? Can you feel the glow spreading through your body? You are awake now, ready for a new day. You have the sun in your tummy. What a beautiful book. I hope you enjoyed today's story. Until next time, thanks for tuning in.